Hello, this is Brian Paul Barrett, and um, welcome to the Mandela Effects, Brian Paul Barrett's Mandela Effects New Moon on Mondays and uh, Truthful uh, Tuesdays, New Noon on Tuesdays. I'm gonna. Sh I have a few things I want to show you about about the uh, said the logo changes and those popular reportings of the logo changes. It, I'm doing a reality test, um, and I, I, I want. I, I'm hoping to gather many of the YouTube fans to um, to answer uh, from this image here to see what what you actually see. What you actually see. This is a reality t uh, vision sight test of one's consciousness, of your own vision. What you see. Okay. Um, first of all. Somewhat recently, in, uh, around in the fall, I actually discovered this either, like uh, the toy maker that makes a lot of the preschool product, products, like microphones. There's another xylophone I have. But uh, this one is a known brand for toy makers for a long time. It's Little Tykes. We're going to take a close look. Very close look. You can't see it super clearly on this. Um, the words are very bold. Um, uh, here it is. Now you see. Notice the spelling. Okay, is it? Is it L I T T L E, which is usually is always been, always that. But that the second the second word, uh, types, is not always the same in some realities, in some people's visions and so forth. What do you see? Is it spelled on the second word? T, I, K, E, S, or is it T, Y, K, E, S? Do you see is T, Y, K, E, S, and do you actually see a normal S? I like a normal standing S or a lowercase S or do you see a slanted S that goes about a 45 degree angle on that, that very last letter. Once again, the little tykes. Is it a... Is it the, the T I K E S or is it T Y K E S? Once again, is it t, t, on this Belian xylophone? Is it T Y K E S? If you see a Y K Y K E S, please comment. Please comment on it. Some people may see things other than me. I see is T I K E S. I may have remembered it's, it's T Y K E S. It may, I may, and it may have changed before my eyes at some time ago. Here's another one. Some other things I'm gonna. Uh, because of a lot of the hype, maybe uh, this um, hype of the pandemic. A lot of people have been buying disinfectant cleaners and so forth. And then here's a popular one. It's called Clorox. I'm going to take a look at it. Now, it's probably not as popular uh, in terms of reporting Mandela effects. But it, this is a reality test. How do you see it? Is it... Is it C, uh, L, O, R, O, X? 
or is it C H L O R O X? If you see it's C H L O R O X, please comment. It's a it's between, it's this one here. If you see that H and this one that I'm pointing to, uh, please comment. If you see the seven letters, if you see seven letters on this very image, this very bottle I have holding in my hand, please comment. And on this slide, once again, on the slide phone, xylophone, uh, yeah, I'm pointing this. If you see the Y instead of the I, uh, please comment. And, I get, and there's another one that I'm very curious about. The this is the no some some of the some of the logos like the Samsung logo uh, it had the A's uh, as upside down V's. No, there has been reported Mandela effects that people clearly remember the the normal A with the dash, uh, the, which is the third part, the dash and the that makes up the A, the three part. Okay, this is a reality test. On these two of the A's on my arcade, that game system, do you see as as just the the two the two uh, part that is it's like a, a the upside down V? Do you actually see the upside down V's without the dashes, the the under abnormal A's, or do you actually? See uh, the a, uh, the normal A's that does have the dash in the middle, unlike I see. Here it is. That's nice and close. You see the dash in the middle. The normal A's. Please comment on my arcade. If you see the dash in the middle, uh, then the, uh, instead of the upside down B's. Uh, Please comment. I'm very interested about this. Very, uh, very interested. And uh, we're living in strange times, and uh, we've been a lot of there's been a lot of reports about unexplained changes in logos, in realities, and so forth. Yep. So you see, the game is on. The game is on. The game is on. And um, the uh, last. Is the American flag? No, um, I have a YouTube fan who really is into that stuff, named Jen, and the I see is white. This is the white stripe next to the blue. On this flag here, if you see the red stripe, if I'm put, if that's red here next to the blue, uh, box with white stars, if that's the red stripe, and I'm pointing to here. On this, uh, on this uh, red, if that's a red stripe, please comment. If that's the red stripe, once again, if that's the red stripe, uh, on on this part here, right next to the blue window, with white stars, please comment. If you actually see stars, uh, more than fifty stars or less than fifty stars on this flag here. Uh, also, please comment. That's another reality test. If you see anything other than 50, no, I'm, I might hold it for a little bit so you guys see count how many stars. If there, was a, if you see any, if you see 51 or 52 or 48, other than the what I see, 50, please comment. Please comment, folks. You no, know, some people may be seeing things differently. But the bigger part, the people really more like the past remember things of what it was before that it actually the reality shift changed. It changed. But uh, yeah, this is a. Uh, I guess a number of people actually clearly remember that uh, the District of Columbia was the smallest state in, in the United States of America. The District of Columbia, D.C. in Washington, D.C. District of Columbia, and Puerto Rico would be is number two. Puerto Rico was it has been the actual state, and the other side, the other the other Earth, the other reality, 
And then some people clearly remember there might be as many as 54 states or 60 states, like the U.S. Virgin Islands, Gu uh, Guam, and I think there's a few others. Um, and, and so, yeah. Uh, so, this is... Uh, so, we're in kind of... Uh, we a little bit about in the third week of April when we had the celebrated Patriots Day. And I really, normally we have the Boston Marathon. And this year, I wish it was a Mandela effect. I wonder if it was actually a Mandela effect and no coronavirus exists. That would be nice, huh? If no coronavirus exists, it may. It may, eh? but then you never know. But, um, yeah, normally there was no, there, we had the Boston Marathon. And kids on April school breaks for the week, and then unfortunately it's been postponed uh, to uh, September fourteenth, Monday September fourteenth. They're gonna have it, most most likely. Uh, so, I would like to see many comments on this on this video, and uh, I got the special artifact uh, for this video as well too. Yep, the artifact. So. Please comment on these things.